So now that we're done with the onshore processing, I'm going to take the ice packs and the shipping label out of the cooler that's been sent to you, and at the same time place the algae raw water and HAB vial back into the cooler so that this is not frozen. We're going to take the bottles that do need to be frozen and place them back into the numbered bag, seal up the bag, place these along with the ice packs into the freezer where they'll stay overnight. The next day we'll retrieve them, place them into the cooler along with packing material. After that we're going to place the paperwork onto the cooler making sure that the paperwork has been completed, the sampling record, the waiver form that should be filled out before any volunteers sample, the field observations form, chain of custody, and also the sea slap shallow water sample. We'll close up the box. We'll tape the box and place the shipping label on top. Now if you collected a shoreline algae bloom sample, this is going to be shipped separately in the small cooler. Note that the bottle has a red label. We'll place this in the cooler along with the ice pack. Close the cooler and place the paperwork on top. The completed shoreline HAB form should be sent with the small HAB cooler if you are submitting a HAB sample, but should be completed and sent with the larger sea slab cooler if you are not sending in a bloom sample. Then we're going to close the box. Tape it up, and place the shipping label on top.